Good morning. So me and my girlfriend, we moved here in March. And I wanted to show you this part of the place. Uh, cows used to be here, behind me. And over there. Uh, 14, 15 of them, I think. Uh, this was an active farm from 1911 up until 1986. With horses, sheep, you know, so on. It's a beautiful place. And this is where I spend a lot of time, especially on the outside, renovating this beautiful building. Yeah. Now, I have a warning, and this is no joke. This is a warning to you politicians, you upcoming politicians. And I want to warn you about globalism, because we, I see some signs. Uh, these globalist politicians... After a few years, they start to look unhealthy, sick. It's true. I talked about this before. I know, I'm not joking. Uh, and now there's this new example with Angela Merkel. You know, they were playing the uh, German national anthem at some event, and she was shaking like crazy. And then she tried to explain it. She said she was dehydrated. And then it happened again. Some other event. She was standing there and shaking. And it's evident to me this woman is not well. It's not that I care about this woman. I just care about the new politicians. You know, Don't drink this globalist poison. No. Get out. Get away from it. It's not good for you. And there's so many examples. The old ones, of course, uh, or the older, you know, Giefer Hofstadt, for instance. He looks really bad. <laughs> yes, he does. Uh, we have uh, Hillary Clinton, of course. Very sick woman. Uh, Jean Claude Juncker. Another shaker. He's not well. But also the young ones, see, Emmanuel Macron, for instance. You, you start to see the signs already, I think. It's mainly the eyes. Yeah, something happens to the eyes with these guys. I can't explain it. Something happens to the eyes. But also the facial expression and the gestures. Hmm. Justin Trudeau, another example. Uh, he's been governing Canada for not a long not a long time but already you see him you know, he's starting to uh, look worse <laughs> that's basically the um, observation they don't look well and uh, we have a very good example here in Sweden it's Annie Löv she is uh, the party chairman of the center party and when she started off, when she started to become well-known, she looked great, relaxed, happy, healthy. She looked good. And now she doesn't. Something happens to these guys. Yeah. She really looks terrible. She does. You know, she's still putting on a nice dress and makeup, but you can see it. It's uh, obvious. Yeah. And I'm concerned about the new Liberal Party chairman. She looks great. Yeah. She's been away from politics for some time. And now she's the chairman of the Liberal Party. Yeah. I'm concerned about her. I don't want to see her go the same way, you see? Yeah. So that's my warning. Don't go globalist. It's not good for you. All right. Stay away. I think maybe it's got something to do with decency and honor. You know, where you're selling out. You're selling out your soul to these uh, globalist assholes. And I can understand that the money is tempting. You know, they throw money at you. They throw a career at you. They offer you a nice career. And money. Don't take the bait. It's not good. All right, that's all. Bye.